Logan Paul and KSI have designed a hydration drink called Prime. They quote that it's the best tasting hydration drink on the market. However, is it backed up by the science to actually be beneficial for hydration? The main electrolyte responsible for hydration is sodium, as it has been shown to retain fluid. Prime only contains 10 mg of sodium. Compare this to say some electrolyte tablets is around 190 mg of sodium per serving, or in Lucozade it's around 200 mg. So it's much less than these two drinks. Therefore, we don't think you'd retain as much water and also you wouldn't increase blood plasma volume as much. It's got 700 mg of potassium. This um, electrolyte in terms of hydration is not that beneficial just because you don't lose much through sweat. Generally, the higher the sodium content in the drink, the more beneficial it will be for hydration. A study in 1998 by Shreves and Morgan actually had a look at a variety of um, drinks with different sodium solutions at 25, 50, 75 and 100 millimoles. And they actually found that higher the sodium content of the drink, the lower the urine um, output, but also the higher blood plasma volume. In terms of a study in 2002 by Sat et al, they had a look at coconut water compared to a carbohydrate electrolyte beverage. Now, Logan Paul claims that this drink contains 10% coconut water. However, in terms of the science behind coconut water, it has been shown that it has a benefit on hydration. To compare it to, say, carbohydrate electrolyte beverages, it's probably not as good. The reason for that is, is the carbohydrate electrolyte beverages still contain higher sodium compared to potassium, they're a bit higher in carbohydrates. So the carbohydrates actually um, slows gastric emptying. New study in 2002 by Roland Zetel actually found that around two to 3% hypotonic solution of carbohydrates is probably optimal for rehydration. In 2015, Morgan analyzed a, a, a variety of drinks on a beverage hydration index. They found that drinks that contained higher sodium content, but also carbohydrates, actually had a higher um, hydration score. So in this study, all solution, oral hydration drink and milks and some orange juice actually scored higher in terms of um, hydration compared to other drinks. As you can see by the graphs on the Shreffs uh, Morgan study from 1998, in terms of the urine output, it is much lower with the higher sodium content compared to the lower ones. And also the blood plasma volume actually raises a lot more with the higher sodium content. So as we know, the blood plasma volume is really important from a hydration perspective, especially on performance. In terms of the study by Satetal in 2002, comparing coconut water and carbohydrate electrolyte beverage, as you can see, especially around the fluid and urine output, and also the blood plasma volume, there's not that much difference. So it wasn't really any significant effects of coconut water compared to the carbohydrate electrolyte beverage. From that perspective, it is no superior at all. Prime does not contain enough sodium electrolytes to have really have any benefit on hydration. Therefore, what we would recommend is just getting some hydration tablets. So you can get these from either like Nutrition X or any main nutrition companies. And adding one or two electrolyte tablets in 500 ml bottle of water and certainly have this maybe an hour pre-training, but you could also have it during training. If it's a really hot day, or it's a really hard training session, then you can still have an electrolyte tablet in a bottle of water after training too, just to help that rehydration processes. If you want in Boxing Science to analyze any supplements, please get in touch on the comments box below. Also, if you've got any questions, please send them over to Boxing Science underscore nutrition on Instagram.